It was at that moment I realized the other man had taken the wrong baby. Then, you're Masumi Arakawa's son. Yeah. I dreamed that it's 40 years ago, on that cold New Year's Eve night. Agan is there, and she's about to give birth to her baby. She gives birth in Shangri-La. In the dream, it's Masato who ends up being born in that soap land. Did Arakawa son know I was his son all along? What's going on with you? <laughs> Finding out that you're, <laughs> you might have had a real dad, and the person that died like two days ago or whatever? Who else? But how? We don't even know where he is. Get Kume to tell me. Where is the bastard? He'll know. Okay, okay. My guess is he's probably giving a speech somewhere. Maybe he's at the Bleach Japan office? Yeah. Most likely the Haku Ryo building. So is, isn't Kume's, uh, speech tour, uh, really? like, on his website or something. We're going to then. Yes, but, you know, we don't have time to remember these things, he asked. <laughs> you might be wondering how we got here. Yo, Kasuga-kun. We were just gonna call you. They're all Omi Alliance men. Not that they'll admit it. Are they just staring at us? Yeah, and more of them keep showing up. I don't like this. You can tell they're Omi because of their, uh, their lapel pins. Yeah, I don't think they like us much either. Great. Then we all want the same thing. Hey, we're leaving! Let's just stay out of each other's way! Yo, if you want to just sit there, go for it. But I'm coming through! <laughs> nice. We're skipping right to the good part. Well, quit gawking and bring it on already! Alright, just uh, wasting no time in getting into this fight then. Uh, I guess since this is literally the first thing that happens in the chapter, like, you don't get a chance to switch out your party. Uh, Alright, full mating forecast is a... only hits three people, not everybody, but, you know, it's a... The AoE is still really wide. Cool. Yeah, I don't know. This is just uh, another day, another group of people. Um, this probably would have been a really shitty idea to do gameplay-wise, but I feel like to reflect Ichiban's current mental state, like it might have been an like a, a fun idea to have this chapter of the game, or at least a couple fights here, be uh in the classic. Uh, beat em up style that this uh, series uh, is known for. Mm. I mean, at least giving him like a, a buff or like a permanent like rage status or something would be nice. Yeah, that would have worked too. I mean, like you can't control him. Like, uh, he's going too crazy. Yeah, I mean, gameplay wise, I 
all of these are objectively pretty bad ideas. Uh, but just just for the the narrative uh, flavor, like I think it could have been fun. I mean, like if we're being honest, it's not like you're fighting bosses or anything. If you're having trouble dispatching these guys after you've taken out Joe, you know you got other problems. Really. Yeah, that's fair. And like, and even if it was a problem, that's something you catch in development, and then you just drop all their levels by like 10 to represent that like, they're just mooks that are searching out for you and desperate for the only alliance to come back to power or something. Yeah, they're, they're hardly stum stumbling blocks, and that, uh, the, their staff should reflect that. Let's go! Weak. Going in. Right. Honestly, I'd say the most annoying thing they can do is just call for backup and prolong the fight. <laughs> yeah. like, I feel, uh, the I feel back, like we say that the every time there's a unit that does that, though. Hell yeah. Yeah, you know, I, maybe I just don't like dealing with reinforcements. Eh, it's not really fun, for being honest. Hey. Is there ever a game where dealing with reinforcements is ever fun? Uh. Okay. Yes, and I, I would like to stress that it's mostly, if not solely, because the units that can call in reinforcements can't do it multiple times, and the people that get brought in can't, period. <laughs> okay. Yeah, like, if there were, like, a hard cap on it, just based on, uh, you know, the enemies, uh, that can do it, that'd be, that'd be a little more okay. Yeah. But I think, I think, like, in that fight, for example, everyone could call in backup, even the backup calls in backup. Yeah. But again, that's how you fix it, is you make it so that it's a very limited amount, so that you're not just swamped or tired <laughs> afterwards. Yeah. Anyway, let let's go let's go find Kume. Just gotta check to see if there's a mini metal over here. Yep, there there it is. Sneaky little devil. Uh, there's a little cafe here. I. I believe this is also the same Should building that Tart Time Hero Sweet. is uh, headquartered in. Yeah, it's at the ground floor. Right over. Anyway, Very not not too much else interesting. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. we'll just uh, move on to uh, the Bleach Japan building. I'm actually surprised you haven't gone to the that upper left corner yet. I did, didn't I? Wasn't that where the batting uh, cage was? Yeah, but like, have you explored around there yet? I don't hey, forget yeah. if you have. I thought I did. Oh, well, anyways, mm -hmm. <laughs> it's just been so long. My memories. Yeah. Gone. Yo. I do like that the uh, traffic reacts accordingly to uh, a street fight just happening here. <laughs> You're in it now. You're in it now. You're gonna get 
It must be such a regular occurrence for them to just be patient. Like, uh, <laughs> I'm not gonna back up or <laughs> drive around or anything. Well, they can't back up because people just keep walking behind them too. <laughs> I mean, I'm just trying to do so. <laughs> the road is for cars, hate. not people. I would hate driving around here, and you know what? They are trying to assert themselves. I can hear them honking. <laughs> These people just don't give the first shit about them. I love that the somersault kick can, uh, brainwash enemies that weren't hit by it. Like, they're just so convinced that they shouldn't be fighting against you. <laughs> Fortunately, they're all kind of spread apart, so, uh, I can't just get them all in one go. I don't know why I didn't go after Asada over there. He's about to, to go. Oh, he, he's brainwashed. That's that's why. You're in for it now. Buddy, it helps if you uh, raise the cloth against the person, like you know, put it on them. You're gonna get stung. Come over here. Who wants to go? Take this. So hey, have I shown off the trophy where um you KO someone by getting them run over by traffic before? Uh no, is it for KOing them or just getting them hit by it? You know what? I can't remember. Because I remember uh, you falling into traffic and getting it. <laughs> well, there's a there's also a Chivo trophy, whatever, for uh, knocking enemies into traffic. I didn't think that would count because that guy uh was already KO'd. What do you want anyway? Me. Anyway, this part might get a little hard to watch, so you may want to look away for a little bit if you're a little squeamish. to the cops, ain't you? Why'd you even come here? What the hell's your problem? We need to talk to Kume. Where is he? Huh? Fuck if I know. Eat shit, asshole. Wrong answer. I said, where is he? Better hurry up and answer. Cool it, Ichiban! That's too much! Spit it out! Where's Kume? <laughs> Still don't want to talk? Think you're real tough, huh? Well, I'm just getting started. Oh. <laughs> I bet I could punch you a hundred times before I even get winded. How about you count them for me? I'll take over once you black out. <laughs> Answer my question. Where's Kume? <laughs> Have it your way! Not my fault if your face caves in! Okay! He ain't in Ijincho no more. He went to Kamurocho. What? Why Kamurocho? Remember how you pushed him into that van? Well, he went crying to his mama for help. That's Ryo Aoki now. Kume's gonna wind to Aoki that he can't campaign without more security. Couldn't he have done that without going all the way to <laughs> Kamurocho? You know, just over he the really phone or something? He's fit to win a national election. All right, well, forget Kume. Take me to Ryo Aoki. I can't do that. Even if I wanted to. You killed Arakawa's son. You killed Chairman Hoshino. I answered you. I told you. Everything I know. The whole city's been turned into a hellhole. And I'm still punching my way for you useless fucking grunts. What 
Is he gonna <laughs> fucking take? Ichiban! Ichiban! Shut up! I just... need to talk to him. Masato Arakawa and I need to have some fucking words. He has some shit he needs to answer for. Who the hell? You? Why are you in Ichincho? I was just passing through. Passing through my ass. You helped us out in Osaka, I think. You got a name, big guy? How do you know Arakawa-san? My past isn't what's relevant here. Huh? I don't have the luxury of living out in the open anymore. But that gives me access to things most people miss. Like what? Like how Ryo Aoki's next move will be right here in Ijincho. Huh? What's his next move? I was going to tell you that. But not anymore. What? Don't fuck around, man! Just tell me! I can't neener, say I really neener. Like Haha. <laughs> after what I just saw from you. That, that is kind of what you just said, isn't it? Right now, so man. stupid. Who fucking died and made you king? <laughs> My tone? You're the one who was beating up a guy who couldn't even fight back anymore. It shouldn't take a king to tell you that was uncalled for. <sighs> what the hell is this next move the young master's gonna make? Spit it out! You're too blind with rage right now to understand it anyway. But I'll give you a chance. Come to Komi Jewel after the sun sets. I'll be waiting. Komi Jewel? Songwi is currently taking measures to restore Komi Jewel's surveillance system. But she doesn't know when exactly it'll be back online. Thank you. <laughs> Crazy how similar you are. Hmm? Pardon me? A few years back, I met a man who looked just like I killed him. But then I saw him die with my because no, no, I no. killed him. <laughs> oh. I don't can't say I know who this man is, but I dream. I do get the feeling that he's never killed a man so. in his entire I life. Mm. A body double. Doubt. I take it. Press an X you. a lot right now. <laughs> Memories, dreams <laughs> can either really be trusted. Enough riddles. To become a man's shadow, your body and mind must be united with his for the rest of your life. In turn, a shadow will be born from me someday, a shadow with the same commitment. So you see, Jungi Han is more an immortal entity than he is a man. <laughs> I get it. I don't. Do you know each other or not? We don't. But it's safe to say we share an acquaintance. <laughs> Small damn world, that's for sure. Tell me about it. So what was the thing about going to Komi Jewel? What's over there? Just be there if you care about anything I have to say. It's up to you. So, are you saying you didn't have anything to do with the Serio clan patriarch's death? Of course I didn't. A flat-out denial, huh? What if the public starts to doubt you? The public's rumor mill doesn't concern me. So, just to be clear, we won't find any evidence you were involved, and Sawashiro's lips are sealed, because a man in prison never talks. Even though you ordered him to do it, I got all that right? Is that how you expect me to interpret this? Yes. And lighten up a bit, will you? You need to understand. I don't want to cause my own police commissioner any undue stress. Well, can't say you're succeeding there. The situation is getting more shaky with every briefing. The whole damn Omi Alliance just fell apart, for goodness sake. Out of nowhere. 
And it makes me think that you were never really in control of Masami Arakawa to begin with. Arakawa has already been dealt with. Okay, but wouldn't Sawashiro just take his place? Unless that was yet another miscalculation. I wouldn't ask so many irrelevant questions if I were you. I know you have your concerns, but you need to relax. I have eyes on everything. Do you have eyes on all the Omi and Kamarocho who are now a bunch of unaffiliated, pissed-off thugs? With Arakawa and Sawashiro out of the picture, who's gonna rein them in? I haven't decided yet, but I will. No need to worry. But... That said, I do need to keep my distance from law enforcement right now. Optics and all. I'm sure you understand. So from now on, do not barge in here without my permission ever again, Horinuchi san. It will not be tolerated. Says the guy who barged into national politics without anyone's permission. I whatsoever. don't think you need and then that. Made himself part of <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. You wanted to be Every time I that? hear about like newcomers Trust in politics, it always feels like anything. the old guard is just like uh no one like some old boys club or something. <laughs> Every single time, no matter advice. what country it is. Chaos, do, do you happen to live in America? <laughs> Why, yes. Yes, I do. <laughs> ah, I see. <laughs> huh, I may have found the problem. <laughs> what do you mean it's cool to have politicians that are 70 plus and completely out of touch with their constituents? <laughs> that bastard ought to learn to respect his governor, huh? You want me to teach him a couple of things before? What the fuck were you problem? there, Ishioda? <laughs> Don't do anything drastic. He'll ruin my fun. <laughs> Your fun? He's gonna live the rest of his life at my beck and call. <laughs> but he doesn't know it, and I'm savoring every moment of that. Man, I fucking hate puppet nice. masters. Do you? All right. <laughs> By the way, Kume came up from a ginger. Uh, yeah, they're they're help. they're not great He's to deal with. About lack of security on his campaign trail. <laughs> okay, that's my purview. I'll handle it. As for your purview, how's that little task I gave you coming? I already made arrangements in a ginger. You won't be able to contact me until it's all over. I know a governor's not used to hearing that, but I hope you understand. Ishiura. Sir. You may just have what it takes to be the next chairman of the Omi Alliance. I think I'll make the announcement at the next officer's meeting. <laughs> Thank you, sir. You won't regret it. Ha 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 